May the Spirit give peace to the entire world, heal the plagues of war and of terrorism, as even tonight in London with innocent civilians. Let's pray for the victims and for their families. It is right that when there is great evil, there is real anger. But that anger must be turned on its head into a commitment to justice and not against any group of people, especially members of the Islamic community. They have not done this. We must stand for justice and peace and in unity. It is division that the terrorists want. In New York, the authorities increase security across the city, particularly in areas full of pedestrians and tourists, like here in Times Square. Overnight, Donald Trump called Theresa May to offer his condolences. But on Twitter, the president used the incident to renew his demand for a travel ban on visitors from six mostly Muslim countries. And he also appeared to criticise the mayor of London, Sadiq Khan, for saying there was no need to be alarmed. In fact, Mr. Khan was urging people not to be worried by the increased police presence on the river and its streets. His spokesman said he had more important things to do than respond to Mr. Trump's ill-informed tweets. Ah, what on to I already tweeted that. Fact, I was to say that France was at Britain's side. That was my in the fight against terrorism. I wonder how Donald Trump took that response, you know, as the pain is similar to the way of performance in the last month to the United States are allies. Mr. Clinton is objective to a correct threat. What? And we will have a joint response to it. This is going to cause traffic chaos. Hundreds of police in this area, cordons everywhere around the whole area sealed off. Borough Underground Station, by the way, has just reopened. We're hearing one small sign, perhaps, of a some sort of semblance of normality coming back. But I have to say, a lot of the area around where it happened last night, London Bridge and Borough Market, is still closed. This is, of course, a crime scene, major forensic investigation. Way, even though the three attackers were shot dead by police. Within eight minutes, we're hearing of them first receiving the emergency calls from members of the public. Uh, seven dead, 48 injured, and 36 of those injured still being treated in hospital. You're watching continuing coverage of the London terror attacks here on BBC. We finished last night about quarter past ten. Not in news anymore. Well, much more from the scene here in Borough Market, but we're going to go to a weather forecast now purple? briefly. Oh, and John yeah. and Darren Bell. Yeah. Hello there, it's been a mixture of sunshine and showers <laughs> over the weekend, but there's some wet and windy weather set to arrive for the beginning of the new week. And it's this area of cloud here that's developed okay, into that's uh, uh, quite okay. heavy rain, actually, and that wetter weather pushing its way further into North Island up towards Scotland overnight, perhaps the far northwest of England. Okay. For most of England and Wales, it should be dry so and clear for most of the night. There'll be a southerly breeze okay. picking up. Okay. Get oh, how do you start when it gets light? Oh, 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 well, so later on in the night, some rain arriving in the west of Wales. Wales, 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 Shouldn't be too windy over across in Scotland. Yeah. We will find some showers uh, following that uh, early rain. We'll begin today with some low showers, which is rather heavy. Showers too, and some sunshine perhaps across Northern Ireland. But we're looking at uh, quite a bit of rain across England and yeah, Wales. Not yeah. so much across eastern England, but it will probably turn a bit wetter here later on in the afternoon. But the uh, steadier and heavier rain is going to be further west, and not just over the hills. At lower levels too, and the heaviest of the rain likely to be across Wales and northwest England. There's a Met Office warning. There could be as much as 80 millimetres of rain here today. Is that so bad? Is it so bad? See how that wet weather well, I'm going to do my garden any on the towards Scotland as well, and the winds start to pick up behind that and blow in some 
showers, quite a few ice bars on the chart. The main area of low pressure takes the rain northwards towards Scotland, where it's going to sit around for a while. Right, I'll see you tomorrow. You will. 
See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. Okay. Bye bye. 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 Bye Oh. I know, I've seen this before. Okay, darling. I don't need any more, thank you. Oh my god. Could be your to go back to what I was saying. Two mysteries in the world. What should be for oh, power apps? I was about to say what should be power apps for Oh, I've seen this video. I'm going to 
that. Okay, the final one. Pretty lies, look me in the face, tell me you don't know me, even if it's fake. Yeah.